the beginning, there was an idea to create a line of tractors that would incorporate the thinking of tractor men from many different countries. This new line of tractors would be produced and marketed under the banner of a single worldwide tractor organization. All dealers in every part of the world would benefit by having their sales and distribution activities carried on within one company. Since the tractor line to be produced had to meet worldwide requirements, marketing experts were called upon to project all of the needs and demands the new tractor would have to meet in many different parts of the world. These men analyzed in detail the special needs of farmers and industrial tractor users in every section of every country. They studied all of the things customers like and do not like about the tractors they now own. They asked customers what features they wanted in the next tractor they would buy. They talked to dealers and analyzed the results of exhaustive marketing research. They developed tractor performance specifications to meet the special challenges presented by requirements in each individual market. This tractor had to have the capability to survive the most trying tests. The tractor was subjected to day in, day out, relentless, merciless testing of hydraulic systems, linkage and controls. As a direct result, the fuel filler was located off-center for greater convenience. The important maintenance and service points were made more readily accessible. A swing-out battery was devised for easier access. The comfort and fatigue factors of the operator were also considered. The seat was built with the aim of keeping a human being comfortable. The steering that handles with a minimum of effort handles still more easily with an optional power assist. The instruments are easy to read. And the hood is designed with practically no obstructions. The unprecedented choice of rugged, dependable transmissions. Four, six, seven, eight, and selecto speed each has the same basic bone-deep quality. Each gets the same patient inspection. The next step was to put it together. Take the proven quality, strength, and reliability of the prototype and build them into each and every tractor on the production line. shouldn't be painted until the grease, grime, and dirt it has acquired in the normal process of being born and made are cleaned off. Basic raw material, skills, and attitudes. Organization. Precision. Precision does not exist unless it is deliberately and painstakingly put in every step of the way. They operated on the basis of a you build it, we bust it philosophy. It was check and double check all the way down the line. Everything, no matter how small or seemingly trivial, was noted.